From DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com, I'm Darren Marlar, and this is your Daily Dose of Weird News. 55 percent of voters surveyed would like to have President Obama back on the job in the White House, possibly including President Trump and many in his family. Now, here's a study that says taking a break from Facebook can dramatically brighten a person's mood. You know, I, I might have to try that. In fact, I should announce that on Facebook. A new study claims that eating more salt will help you lose weight. I could see myself ending up with rock-hard six-pack arteries. Meanwhile, researchers at Imperial College say their new study indicates that sugar-free and diet drinks are not helpful for weight loss and they could even cause people to pile on the pounds. Hey, maybe the diet drinks should change out the fake sugar for salt. There you go, problem solved. Amazon is now worth twice as much as Walmart. And they did it without greeters. If you're trying to lose weight or just eat better so you'll live longer, you might want to stay home at mealtime. The study's authors, who are from Tufts University and the University of Toronto, say restaurants are unhealthy places to eat because the food that's served not only adds to the obesity epidemic but also increases diners' risk for heart disease. All right, fine, okay, I'll make you a deal. I'll start staying home for my meals as soon as the Cheesecake Factory begins offering home delivery. A new study finds that a marriage is more likely to end in divorce if the husband doesn't like his wife's girlfriends. Although I'm thinking it may be even more likely to end in divorce if he really does like one of her girlfriends. Even if you're having a sad desk salad, grab a real fork, knife, or spoon. People who eat with heavy utensils enjoy food 10 percent more than those eating with cheaper flatware, according to a recent study. Co-author Charles McKell, chef in residence at the University of Oxford, says you'll believe the quality of your food is better. So, you know, this is exactly why I bring out the good forks when sitting down to a bowl of puffy Cheetos. A new study claims that red meat increases your chance of dying from nine different diseases. The spokesman from the beef industry only had one word to say – steak. If you want to live happily ever after, then beware Twitter! If you spend too much time tweeting, it could have a negative effect on your marriage, even in stable long-term relationships, according to Health Day News. And that friction can be so intense it leads to cheating and breakups. Why? Well, time spent online is time spent away from your partner and family responsibilities. Well, that might explain Donald Trump's marriages, huh? In Lakeside, Oregon, 42-year-old Elizabeth Mole had apparently pawned her husband's chainsaw. But when he found out, he asked her for the receipt and says she flipped out and hit him over the head with a bamboo stick. Sheriff's deputies were able to locate a bloody bamboo stick on the property and Robert was treated on the scene for several lacerations and scratches to his head. She, the wife, was charged with assault and unlawful use of a weapon and was taken to the Coos County Jail. Now, Here's the really weird part. Yeah, it's bad what she allegedly did, but according to the TV station there, her bail is set at $275 million. What? Michael Moore says he has been working on a secret film that will end the Trump presidency. Has anything Michael done actually affected anything? What we need is a secret film that will end Michael Moore. At a Lowe's Home Improvement store in Virginia, the employees are experimenting with wearing a sci-fi exosuit that allows them to lift extra heavy objects without a sweat. But don't expect an employee to carry your new refrigerator single-handedly to your car, no. He will, however, single-handedly carry your car to your new refrigerator. Right now, you can get a free copy of the book None Other by John MacArthur by visiting marlerhouse.com slash freestuff. Grow deeper in your knowledge of the one true God. Get your book free right now at marlerhouse.com slash freestuff or click the Free Stuff tab at dailydoseofweirdnews.com. Offer expires June 2nd. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe if you want to see more. And click that little bell icon next to the subscribe button to be notified when I post new videos. And if you're already an official weirdo, please share this video on your own social media. Find even more weird news that I didn't have time for on the Facebook page at dailydoseofweirdnews.com. 
I'm Darren Marlar, and I'll see you next time, weirdos. 